Hello everybody, welcome to the BBSL final season 6. We've got Olivier Dulac, the top ranked player on tabletop, with his Skaven, his team of choice, up against Andy Davo, formerly third top ranked on NAF tabletop, with his race of choice, Necromantic. In the booth with me is Dimmy G and Fimir. Hello guys. Hello fans of the sixth season of the Blue Bowl Super League. Today we have finally a champion that will uh, define ages to come. An era ends and another begins. Yep. Jimmy? Uh, hello. <laughs> right. Hello. And we get this out of the way the first thing possible. The game is dedicated to our viewers in... Yeah, no. <laughs> no. 100% no. <laughs> Fiji, Fiji, hey. the South Pacific, capital Suba, the language is English, Fijian and Hindi. They use the Fijian dollar, the national flower is the Tajimusia, and the national is the Fiji Kokoda. Ah, wonderful. Right. wonderful. Big fan of Fiji. Very good at rugby sevens. Brilliant. And uh, yeah, so Olivier won the toss, chose to kick. Um, he's benching is just two line rats. He's fielding the best eleven that he can. He's you know including the leader thrower. Interesting. A lot of people say that guy you know don't field him. Oh, officious ref. Just a stun. Just a a stun. stun zombie. Whew. Whew. Little bit lucky there. Honestly, that could have been a disaster, couldn't it? That could have been like a sent off. You know. Rat Ogre or Gutter Runner or Flesh Wraith. Golem or Wraith or Wolf, yeah, that, so that was... I mean, it, it wouldn't have been a rat it? because Andy lost it. Well, I mean, he oh! could have he could have not lost Ooh. it. Dave Scals to start. That uh, proves that Andy Day was a true professional because being Dave Scals, his first role of the game, doesn't matter what happens, he was the uh, dice. <laughs> wow, what a start. Rats, of course, immune to claw. Yes. Yes. But not the rat, not the rogue. Not the rogue. No. The rogue and the rogue the blitzers, yeah, but uh, generally immune. Oh, first KO. Mm. Devo, not perturbed by that dub skulls. He's not. He's not uh, moving anything over to cover the ball yet. Just has to bang. Just stun on that one. So, I mean, this is kind of expected, one of three removals. He's going to get to blitz one of the players. The, the in, interesting thing is he didn't put his... I guess he's just going to free dice? Yeah, 3D it? with the... With uh, is he going to put the ghoul in? No, oh, the, the, the wolf fashion. is already there. Yeah, sorry, the wraith is blocking him. So, yeah, 3D with a Yeah. But, yeah, I think if, there's, if it's just one removal, I think Olivier will be... Like expected it, not really happy, but not really unhappy. Yeah. So no pal. Not good. Yeah, there you go. So about right. Problem is, is uh, Olivier is not got. Oh, he's anyone. very narrow, isn't he? Very narrow, Devo. This is so narrow. Oh, and he gets the pickup. Oh, that was a four blast. And I'm wondering if Oliver will consider uh, hitting the the wolf. There's no, there's no one decent for the rat ogre to bite those or bite or hit is the problem. Uh, will Olivier just go around here? It's it's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, that's a very good point. Uh, he's playing this leader leader throw, right? That could have just been a, a rookie. I think maybe he's feeling the rookie was a better move but you know who can say if it's good or bad perhaps he wanted the reroll hmm this is two into three you're gonna bite the mighty blow surely he's just not gonna activate the roll but i thought he'd run away from the roll no 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 full pal armor break just a stun remove you that's a zombie gone and now we're going to get four gutters in the backfield, right? We are. Because it's too that narrow. Is this is very narrow from Dave. I, I wouldn't be surprised to see yeah. four gutters in the backfield. 
needs to go a little bit deeper with the other guys. So. Here we Head go. Back. He should be hugging the sideline. No. No, only Ooh. two. No, I, I don't like this there. too much. I don't like this too much. Yeah, I like three from the backfield. Yeah, this is just saying kill my sidestepper and cage up here, right? Mm, yes, I think so. Oh, I don't know about. I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> now you've got to. Uh, now you've really got to power the sidestepper. Yeah, it's going to be six dice with block though, isn't it? So it's not going to be. Well, five dice, but yeah. <coughs> no, he just needs to tag him on. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, he's sidestepping these so it's... Well, he's going to power him on the first hit. That's he fine. probably will, yeah. But this is three dice into three dice. Ah, no, 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 he can go, three, no, he can two. go, uh, yeah. the yeah, go Steps here. Steps down and the zombie, yeah. yeah. Oh, he gets the ball down anyway. Oh, I'm a break. Pretty big. Pretty big. This is really stable now. Yeah. I guess he's like, it's stable, but he's like, he's, uh, he's very, very, uh, you know, compact, isn't oh, he? Yeah, His whole yeah. team is in like a three it's by five two. square. It's, it's ten two. <clears throat> it is, but uh, that's interesting. Oh. Might struggle to get forward. Ooh. Why is that? Now the Roger there? doesn't have any useless uh, player next to it, so if he goes uh, feral, he's gonna hit. Uh, oh, okay, he can move. Yeah, he can just. Yeah, just abandon him. He hasn't got anyone. It's, uh, it's just rubbish now, the rogue. It's just like worse than a minnow, right? Oh, and there you go. Roll a four plus, done. Sorted. Easy. <laughs> then he's going to give his uh, sidestep at a two plus dodge out. So this is the money blow blitz. Bang. He needs to put a gutter here, right? There's a, the, currently, there's a three wide. That it's a three wide and screen. He, and he's not going through there. Do you not reckon? Nah, it's fan two. He's still covering it anyway. What the hell is going in chat here? Uh, the dream with somebody with Stephen Fry. Stephen uh, I, <laughs> 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 I mean, he can chain the mighty blow onto the wraith and then hit that. So he can claw the guard and then chain the mighty blow onto the wraith and get two hits here. Yeah. I'll call the guard. That definitely seems the player, doesn't it? Yeah, and then it also opens up the middle a bit as well, so you can centralise. Yeah, reconnect with this lost zombie. <laughs> and you know, Andy's all about the punching. He just loves to bang, doesn't he? I mean, uh -huh. it kind of makes sense here, too, but... I mean, he's necro. What what the, what the other thing is, you know, that they're using uh, your uh, wolves every time. Hmm. Is he gonna, is he gonna put a flesh column in there? Yeah. He indeed does that. So I guess if you get the pushes on the first one, then you can push it into the golem and then go for the cow on the second one. Oh no, you just change him straight away. Mm. 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 Uh, because Max, it is the Eurobowl rules with um, like any point package. In previous series seasons, we only allowed like one point, but for this, we allowed it. Um, we allowed the two point packages. So Andy has a one point package for extra money, and like he gave up his skill for an extra m for for more money. Whereas Olivier got an extra skill, but couldn't have um, four of the same kind of skill. There you go. How's the mighty blow? And exactly what Jay Leave said. There you go. Thanks, Jay Leave. 
nearly nearly making Dimi very happy with his race selection for the World Championship, but not quite. <laughs> hey. Um. Oh, what knobs? Yeah, he, he hasn't picked knobs, but he's picked something similar to knobs. <laughs> who, who has? Jelly. Oh, is he? So, mm. what's similar to knobs? I guess humans. Oh, OWA is what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> oh. They leave like rubbish teams, though, doesn't they? <laughs> well, like knobs. <laughs> like, knob, knobs are OP to me. It wouldn't surprise me if there was a lot of knobs in uh, the World Cup. I mean, I can think of at least nine. <laughs> you know, there are a lot of knobs in the World Cup, but uh, <laughs> I don't think many people have chosen Imperial Nobility. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there'll be many Imperial Nobility, no. But there's definitely a lot of knobs in the World Cup. Bench is to beat him off there. He's literally fed the Rauger as gutter, a gutter runner. Where does he want him to move to? He's already he's not, blitzed. He's staying, he's staying there. He's staying there. I think... <clears throat> right, how many rats are getting removed this next turn? I'm going to go with two. Mm. Um, um, and then you can hit me with higher or lower. I think lower than two. You think lower than two rats? Three. And, you think three? Three okay. rats. So if it's higher, Bamey wins. If it's lower, Jimmy wins. And if it's two, Jimmy wins. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, let's go. Yeah, I'll remove the coloured circle. I just put it on so that because some people on the YouTubes want it. So I, I try to put it on for a turn or two so that people who want them get a bit of an idea and then everyone else doesn't have to put all them the whole game. Uh, uh, Captain Oates played Olivier Delac before. He's gone for zero. <laughs> <laughs> One negro self removal. There you go. Very good, Jeff. And Jeff is for knobs for the World Cup. <laughs> knobs for the World Cup. Yep, yeah, there's, there's a few knobs. There are a few knobs. <laughs> there's a lot of block plus blocks here, though. There are, yeah, and Devil's already done two re rolls. Uh, but there are a lot of blocks also. Mm-hmm. And then how does he protect the ball? He's got to really visualize the end the final board state here, right? This is the important thing that Andy has to do. And then work out where he's gonna get the ball safe. This is the sort of problem that, you know, Olivier oh. and Chunter like Olivier and Nafstyle style Chunter in ladder. This is the kind of problem they give people and then, you know, if you make all the right plays, it's easy because you know you're you're getting to smash them to bits and you're getting to put the ball in the right place. But if you roll badly or make bad decisions, then it's terrible because you know all of a sudden the ball isn't protected. Oh, well, there's, there's one, one removal instantly. There's one. Does he apple that serious what injury on a guard? Serious injury. I think he might. Does not. No, he is the cat. I mean, it's not a guard runner. It's not a roger. And it's a serious injury, so fair. Well, huge to guard, to guard it guard. helps for the one turn. Yeah, it does. A bit of a pain. Gets to punch the leader here. Yeah, so I guess he's going to cage around here. So he's not going to have a guard in the front. But I mean, he doesn't need guard rates. He's strength three anyway. So that was Anneli's solution. Was to blitz there, you know, with frenzy in the first push into the well, not first, both pushes into the fleshy and clear the leader here. Not a very complicated solution. Uh, Olivia oh, left the center removals. open. This is why I didn't like. I didn't like the roger being here. Right, if the roger's up here, that that solution doesn't work at all. Uh, oh, Olivier, still... use the apple in the thrower. <laughs> oh. yeah, we're still counting that as a removal. Oh, because... are we? Well, it depends if he removes this rat or not. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, okay, no, it doesn't count. It doesn't the count, doesn't count as a removal because he's two on the pitch. No, it's there two. It's two. Once again, it's once two. again. He apoed it. He apoed it so it's two on the pitch. It doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> Three removals once again. I got it right. No, it's two. He's still on the pitch. You can't call it a removal if he's still there. Come on. 
removed. Three removals in one turn, holy moly. Yeah, that's pretty brutal. I, I thought there was going to be some big removals that turn, to be honest. Yeah. There were a lot of hits. I, I think the Rolga had that's to be up there well, as well. It was too well. easy. This was the obvious solution, right? Now, whether Olivier anticipated that and wanted him to get over here, I don't know. I paid a lot for it. I mean, technically, G PC, it is just two removals, so... Think on a technicality, I'm claiming cor correctness. <laughs> That's uh, absolutely wrong, and nobody will say that there were only two removals this time. Everybody will say there was a turn with three removals. We didn't specify what the FO meant before we made the decision, so it was, it was a failure in the process. Oh, we didn't dodge away the gutter first. I wonder what his plans were with the gutter and the other gutter that hasn't moved. I mean, unless this was the absolute best square for this gutter, and this was the absolute best square for this gutter, he should have moved them before they're doing this 3 plus dodge, shouldn't he? So that's interesting. Bit of a turn ordering mistake there from Olivier, maybe. Mm. I mean, maybe maybe this is where he wanted them, but unless this was exactly where he wanted those two players. I mean, he can just, he can just GFI the guard. Really oh, no, he doesn't. Well. He just puts the Wraith in. He puts the, the the left Wraith in, and then he's got a 2D instantly on the Rogar. So mm. It's really easy to clear this. Well, the APC is right, you know. Timmy uh, is there in the actually uh, ready football uh, ready, you know. Actually, you know, I'm a Discord mode, and it was two removal, you know, <laughs> enough style. Blah, blah. <laughs> Meanwhile, once again, the people know the truth. <laughs> Actually, the prawn queen. <laughs> ah, cheeky prawn. <laughs> yeah. well, that's District, District 9, is it? Yeah. That's a good yeah. film. That's yeah, a great film, I thought. Fucking prawns. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Surely you've got to 3D this gutter, right? You've got to bring up that zombie so you can 3D that gutter. 2D the roger. But what else are you doing? How are you getting the ball safe? Like, that's, this is what, you, what you've just got to ask yourself all the time, right? How do you get the ball safe? What are you doing here? How are you... What's happening to get the ball safe every time? And, you know, if you can answer that pretty... You know, pretty well either you know make the right moves or don't roll badly and these kind of games can be pretty easy did you get a lot of hits oh no knockdown re-rolls it gets the full power full and instant power <laughs> it <was> so slow <laughs> Well, if we want something fast, the J5, as you try the high voltage mode in a, a Marvel Snap. <laughs> it's only three times of Marvel Snap. Nice. With extra energy. So you end up having done with 10 energy and things like that. Oh, there you go. This Lots of dice being thrown around. And there's the AV break. And another removal. And the KO. And, uh, there are many chances that... They, oh, he chose the <laughs> bot down just to... Stun himself. <laughs> stun himself. is a little uh, degree, but now more or less. Uh, and he has it easy. Yes. Yeah, I'd say. Really easy? We've got the Rat Ogre dodge, jump over the wall <laughs> into sack here, I think this is a guaranteed ball sack. Yeah, do me. Juggernaut, OP. Yep. But no grab. No grab. No. You can't have oh. grab, can you? No, no, you can't have grab and frenzy. Uh. And now it's going to be... One day? Uh. No. no. Yes. Yes. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh yeah. There you go. Oof. Oh, cause the lucky goal. boy. Oh, the goal. But the side steps does a thing. Yeah. Probably up. 
Uh, maybe down right to stop because if he goes up he can get punched by the mighty blow so yeah down or out yeah this yeah is... but he was uh, up he was already tagging the leader yeah but he would have just he would have just got punched right the mighty blow could have punched him whereas now he hasn't got any punch sorry i mean up oh in the diagonal god. oh diagonal up yeah 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 yes oh my god this is just suicide it is Yes, so did you, there are modes. I'd like to point out that Davo got more removals in that one turn than I did in 24 against Olivia. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I was hitting it with Mighty Blow. <laughs> yeah. Well, you got dice, didn't you, Dim? I'm, I'm over it, don't worry. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not bitter at all. <laughs> oh, stand firm, doing a thing. Well. This is interesting, though. Yeah, I mean, he's not got forward, has he, Dave? Like, he's made a million removals, but he hasn't got forward yet. But you know, I think I would have already hit the side stepper by now. I wouldn't have even thought about it. <laughs> gone, Gosh, feel dead. Well, the problem is he's got to think about where the ball's going and stuff, and how is he keeping yeah, it safe, and I how mean, is he getting that, people in that, range? <laughs> that wolf is doing nothing but hitting that side stepper. Well, you don't know, to me, you don't know. It's, 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 I, guess, uh, right, I guess he could hit the ramp, but... Oh, Ooh. Blitz with the ball carrier! Yeah. Instant full power! <laughs> Not a removal. So he's got... three players. Hmm... So he's gonna leave an uphill. He could he could one into two on the lineman, right? So to free to free the uh, wraith. Yeah, I think he will. Yeah, he's doing it, Jim. He's doing it. Mm. Ooh, oh, did a he's he's down to zero re rolls. Did essentially an irrelevant oh. block. Yeah, that punch. wasn't a very... He to punch the leader, isn't it? He wanted to punch the leader. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That wasn't a good block, Hellboy. Yeah, you, you You're right, the... Merino. The important one was this one, right? The one into two, and now he hasn't got a reroll for it, but he gets the pal. And the armor break, and the KO. I feel like he had to do that block before the before the fleshy. I guess. Oh, did the fleshy one cut the corner? The fleshy one cut the corner. So, so yeah. So the fleshy block pushing him meant that the wraith could get there without you know. Mm. Otherwise, I think the wraith could only got here. So it actually did matter the the fleshy block. But Very I still funny. think you do the wolf block first. So that you know, if you have to re-roll that, that you at least get a a bad cage, which is better than no cage at all, right? Hmm. Hmm. I right. it's not like he's in a much danger uh, right now. He's gonna run away with a stripper, but then all he's gonna do is blitz with the rape and clear the golem and grind down the field. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't say it's a dicing, no, I, I think, you know, it's been, it's been a bunch of removals, but I've kind of got to accept that, oh my god, he's, he's, oh my he's god. already re-rolled it, he's given up the one turn, Olivier. Wow. Removal. And a removal. Rag has got to hit the wolf, one into two. Got to hit the wolf, Olivier. Yeah. Yeah, 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 you can leave the rocket there. The push. That's what he wants. Push him down. Nice. Down okay. That's not bad. At least it, you know, at least it stops him getting quite far forward with it. Yeah, yeah. Considering that Oliveira is going to have a, has a three players. Wow, didn't foul the leader. I would have been tempted to foul the leader at the end of this. I mean, he has, he's just started his turn, didn't he? Yeah, I know. But yeah, but that that's the only zombie. zombie. I mean, I don't see him uh, fouling with a uh, wolf. I guess he has to blitz the mighty blow. He could, uh, he could double GFI foul at the end. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he's gonna blitz with the uh, with a zombie here. Actually, he, uh, 
perhaps. Because like nothing seven. else can, right? He's just moved the guy who could have blitzed. Turn seven. I guess he could just dodge. He could just dodge away from him. It's a one in nine, which is just the same as blitzing with a zombie. He's gonna right? eye cage, isn't he? He's gonna eye cage with guard. Yeah, That's GFI good. to get the cage. One, two, three, four, five, oh, six. Okay, you cage behind him. You cage behind. Oh, behind him, so. him, but then you're another square away, aren't you? That's okay. Yeah, One, two, it's three. Gonna do, it's gonna do a line. Yeah, that's okay actually. Yeah, you can get there. Uh, yeah, you can reach. Is he going for a full cage? Is he gonna? Hmm. The thing is, like, eye caging isn't that good because he's already strength three anyway, right? So, so he's, he's just gonna go there and then GFI to full cage. GFI in a full cage is way better. But... Or he could just stand there. No, I think he'll GFI to full cage. I think he'll move the zombie, bleeds with the Volcari. Oh, no. Yeah, that's the bits with the zombie. But if you just dodge, right? Like, this, this, do, this is a, obviously a better failure state, blitzing with this. But, like, if there was a better blitz to be made, he could have made a better, like, you know, he could have blitzed this gutter runner. And if he powered him, then the flesh he could have got there without a GFI. So. Oh my god! <laughs> KO. And another KO! Easy is <laughs> day at the. At the pitch for uh, <laughs> <laughs> for Andy Davo. Wow! You know, I was rewatching uh, Silence of the Lambs uh, earlier, and now we know who's giving the lotion and who's putting on the lotion. <laughs> Now, now, as Olivier is here, do you just say okay, score or? Puts in his last re-roll, rolls a skull. Why? Casses himself. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah. I was going with you know he could have moved down and have the chance of the one turner. <clears throat> he didn't even hit the wall first. No, I mean the strip was the strip was pretty good, right? Because if he if he drops it, it's only fifty fifty for Andy to score, right? So. No re -roll. Yeah. But um. But then if Andy doesn't score and the KOs don't come back, then <laughs> it's still pretty yeah. awful. True, true. Somebody did predict an easy win for Andy. So far, that's how it's panning out. Um. I mean, it's things can change. There's things can change, yep, yeah, and nothing can well, change as much uh, there as there is still a lot of KOs for the rats. Uh, yeah. if, he gets, if he gets all three KOs back, then it's 11 against 11. 10 versus 11. No, only yeah, 11 versus 11, yeah. Yeah, I can oh. count him. All right, dude. I thought there were three cars. That's, I mean, I did count, I just thought there were three. <laughs> <laughs> he just, he did count, but just incorrectly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Hold on, mate. <laughs> he counted, you know, but uh, he did. He ran the numbers, but he's bad at math. <laughs> yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You know, that's the time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and for those that are just arrived uh, tomorrow, Jimmy's gonna be part of the beginning of the World Cup with some uh, new information. Mm, yes, very the Blue Ball Three World Cup. Yeah, the near. He live in France. <laughs> <laughs> which he, he will need, you know, again, getting the embassy involved and all that, because uh, Jimmy lives in Darlington. And you know what else is in Darlington? The TV license company. <laughs> I got a letter the other day, and he said, the headquarters in Darlington. So that's why Jimmy doesn't go out as much. His house is surrounded by bands <laughs> of the <laughs> TV licensing company. <laughs> we heard that... We heard the great British uh, bake off, Jimmy. Come out! <laughs> it was just a YouTube highlight. It was a YouTube highlight. <laughs> They've never heard the great British bake off in my house, I tell you. Oh, sorry, it's strictly come dancing. Yeah, yeah, strictly, strictly. You know, we hear Richard Attenborough voice. It's AI, it's AI. <laughs> The only issue with this is if he powers the rave. Uh, 
<laughs> if he pals the wraith on the left. Uh, yep. It's yep, because there's nowhere he can size up to, is there? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the clear play. You you power the wraith and then you blitz the blitz the zombie. You've got to do like you know, gutter dodges and everything. It's still ridiculous, but it is ridiculous. But it's possible. <coughs> Oh, he, he's just gonna he's gonna hold method. He's gonna power the wraith, then he's gonna hold method. Okay. Well, what if the wraith gets powered into the hole? That's a good point. He should probably have a gutter in the hole and then move said gutter from the hole. All right. So, what are the chances here for the one uh, turner? Not I, I think they were. Yeah, no, they're pretty much non-existent. You ain't got um, enough players. If you have more players, I guess that that's one way of doing it is power this guy and then and then move a gutter out of the way around somewhere and then push this guy into the hole and hole method it. Um, and I guess the, what he's trying to do is something else, which is I mean, maybe he's just surf the zombie, yeah. surfing a zombie, which is yeah. it's something. Yeah. Not good, is it? Nice use of a uh, Jagger now. No, uh, I won't the give to get in the oh, until I'm victorious. And mm. I will defend. I will defend. No region. No region. Incredible like, Jagger. Like, uh, Dimmy's uh, ghouls. <laughs> yeah. Like my ghouls. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, thank oh. you very much. Is Flamingo staying fantastic for 44 months? 11 glorious beaver pregnancies. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Girls are loud in JLS blurring out, indeed. Nope. How are these KO rolls? And he gets his back. One failed for Olivier. So he's on 10. 10. As Jim predicted. <laughs> it's not bad. It's still a game. It's still a game. Yep. The uh, stripper's an issue. Or lack of. I say. Well, he's in attack now, so the strip ball is not as uh, relevant. Besides the fact that he's a gutter runner. <laughs> Yeah. Now uh, Olivier needs uh, a crazy turn. So yeah, still full strength team for Andy and uh, Olivier down a gutter runner and a guard blitzer like you know down to alignment. So he's only he's still got ten players, but he's feeling the quality loss as well. I mean, losing the guard, which also has blog, losing the gutter, tough. That's pretty bad. It's looking grim for Olivier, you know, now he's got to use his rerolls to get the score done, like Dakar or not <laughs> Dakar. If he doesn't Dakar, I just think he loses 2-0. He's, he's only got two minutes of his time bank left as well. Uh, only oh, is this a bug? This is a visual bug, right? This could be the visual bug, yeah. Yeah, there's no way he's been that slow. No, but then J5 said Olivier's really slow, so maybe... Oh, he's oh, known he uh, for his statements. It must be true then, J5 said it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he's on 7.30 on Andy's stream, yeah. So it's, oh, okay. it's the bug, yeah. Oh, look at that kid. The kick. Oh. oh, no blitz. Knuckle dusters. No blitz, Knuckle dusters, a mighty blow wolf. Oh, Andy got it. Yeah. Oh, oh my Jesus. God. Oh, my perfect God. kick and the oh, mighty blow wolf. Oh, oh wow, brutal. Brutal. Yeah. Don't say it's over, but it's uh, very, very bad for Olivier. Lady Equity smiles at Andy Dable right now. Hit with the blood we're gonna, we're gonna roll a blitz, right? We're gonna roll a blitz here. Why did he hit with a blood scar? Surely that. It's got block in it. Can't go. Oh, oh wow. God. GG. Nice Rogan, mate. Where'd you get it? <laughs> Tries to put in the rear. Lone, oh, there you go. Tragedy, hearts broken in France. Oh dear. 
The only thing that's going to save this is if Andy fails to pick up. Yeah. Well, I mean, the rogue. It's the worst, isn't it? It's the worst big guy in the game. Incredible. I'm glad that that's happened. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> but yeah, it sucks in terms for the game and for Olivier. This looks pretty yeah. over. Um, but you know, if, if um, that was the blizzard, he thought maybe he should have done everything else before doing that. Yes, yeah. Well, the, he needed the rat next to him to guarantee the blitz. But yeah, the ball pick okay, up. Okay, then you leave that uh, rat uh, to the end because now. <laughs> oh, he might be saved here. Step mm -hmm. to the sideline. Yeah. Well, that's not gonna but he can step on it again. Oh, and he's not being powered. Well, now he won't step on it, right? He'll step directly left, yeah. Now he's got a screen. Oh. <laughs> and oh. can surf the wolf. Oh. Very good, very good uh, uh, for Olivier there, considering, all considering. Yeah, maybe Andy didn't think that through quite enough. He just thought, yes, murder, and then was like, oh, fuck. Oh, mighty bro, mighty yeah. bro, here we go. Oh man, genius from Olivier to, to tempt Andy into this. <laughs> and now the ball is one square, one square closer to the thrower, all according to plan. Yeah. Only, it doesn't put in both guards, so only putting in one guard. Trump two. Yeah, but I mean, he can still uphill, right? He, like, they can't, he, I would have put in two guards, so he'd have to 3D uphill. Whereas now he can 2D uphill. Which is uh, a lot better. Oh, he's still got the goal as well. But the goal, I mean. <coughs> oh, well. Yeah, you got got old Bill Surf, and then and then like you could actually just blitz and then run away and pick up the ball afterwards as well, couldn't you? Uh, oh. What? what? Ah, that cancels the assist yeah. and the one on the wolf, but using the thrower was the only piece? Yeah, well, he could use that line on Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that guy. too far, the line or too far, so yeah, it was pretty much just the thrower. Everything else was dice or a gut run, I mean, the gut run you don't want to use, right? So, yep, just got uphill now. Blockless uphill. Yeah. Blockless uphill for the... Final of the Blue Ball Super League. Here we go. Whatever happens is going to be a spectacular result one way or the other. Yep. Doesn't nope. get him yet. Doesn't get him. And uh, spectacular it is. <laughs> Armor break, stun, and then I think, I think. Andy could pick up the ball this time. <laughs> Maybe, yes, he might have a shot at it, yeah. I even put a reroll in. He may, yeah. <laughs> Maybe he has to invest a reroll. Yeah, it's, it's not over, but it's. Uh, it's <laughs> well, it's as over close. once he picks it up. It's as, picks well, it's not. It's never over, is it? You know, come on, let's let, let's Elliot this. It's not over till no, the, uh, like, till it's I'm, over. I'm, but I'm it's sorry. it's over. But it looks very bad. It yeah, looks very it's bad. It's almost now, over. I'm now sorry. we are gonna have to watch uh, how Olivier plays the desperate blue ball. <gasps> Did Olivier? Oh, I didn't know this guy's at the back. Does Olivier? No, maybe not. He's got he's got a stripper here. He can get the ball back. That's a wrestler, Jim. So he's got a wrestler here. He can get the ball back. Yeah, the stripper <laughs> is dead. Yeah, yeah maybe. That, uh, that's again, shows how the field design of Blood Bowl, you know, the, the <laughs> farthest view is not as far as it should be. Oh, he's not going to pick up. Oh, I guess we're going for the blood school then. What are you doing, Jim? Stop Sorry, that. I was just trying to work out if there's a better angle. No, oh, there is not. Thing I should do in the middle of a another game, removal, yeah, another did. removal, making things uh, for the reason. And this could be—is this going to be Andy Davis becoming? If he wins, 
two-time BBSL champion. Yes, he will be the first ever two-time Blood Bowl Super League champion. Oh my God, if someone has told me this years ago when I started subscribing to this channel, I will never believe it. <laughs> Is this another? Yeah, this is another 3D as well, isn't it? Full it me. Yeah, PC. Counting that your plan to get rid of Ian McKellen didn't work, <laughs> maybe Blood Bowl. Blood Bowl is. has to come back to Blood Bowl. <laughs> oh dear. That was a little bit late, that time. All right, for me. First oh. time. Easy, oh, easy. easy with a six. Showing dominance. So we yep. got the K five, five plus. Uphill wrestle. Yep, two D uphill. With the GFI symbol, probably. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the uh, the classic, you know, miracle roll. I don't think he's now even as that now. I think it's basically over. But it's don't say it's over. Oh, fails. <laughs> it's over, Jim. <laughs> Don't say it's over. <laughs> Good put. Waiting for the opponent. I think this is over. <laughs> I think Olivier just uh, probably went to uh, Andy uh, and said, look, this is it. Congratulations. It's Andy's turn. Uh... Yeah, I mean, he's in the upper uh, right at the waiting for the opponent, so... Even the injury was a snake. Well. Do you know what? Do you know what I think Andy's doing now? Is trying to surf the gutter runner, the sidestep gutter runner. No, he's decided against it. <laughs> I've got a feeling that's what he was thinking. Because it was possible, right? But um, decided to be sensible instead. Oh, oh, oh double skulls! It was almost exciting for a moment. Almost. There you go. There was the the uh, clickbait title was nearly there. You never believe what happens to <laughs> <time> eleven. <laughs> the clickbait title is BBSL Final Season Six. Almost exciting for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Jim's oh, right again. I, 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 I mean, I, this is how it goes, right? Like, ultimately, this is how the game goes, right? Either it's kind of, it's either kind of easy for Andy or it's a nightmare for Andy, right? Like, that's, that's how it oh goes. Oh my God! What a statement! What a statement! Yeah, yeah there's, it's ve there's very few close games in this kind of thing. Because just the way it goes, right? Olivier swarms the cage, and either you don't you don't remove anybody, and it's a nightmare, you know, or you just get your fucking six free hits, remove three players, and you're like, all right, good, easy win then. So it it it, it tends to be very polarized. The games tend to be polarized when people play like this. Ah, yes, that will be Andy's. Yes, PC. Yeah, yeah. He is not wrong. He is not wrong. He is the best. If he says tabletop. No, no. Highest ranked. Highest NAF rank. Highest rank. Not world's best. Not an insult to Olivier. It's just. It's just. It's just. I always think it's a silly thing to say when people say number one ranked is the world's best player. It's. It's just not true, right? It's like saying whoever that got the highest SR on Blood Bowl three. You wouldn't say they're the world's best player. You wouldn't say whoever's got the highest uh, CR on Fumble's the world's best player, would you? It's just like it's just weird that table toppers say the world, you know, the world number one rank. They call him the world's best, but it's it's just incorrect. <laughs> but you know, he's definitely the highest ranked and has been for ages. You know, like you know, all credit to him for that. Very impressive. Well, the others wanted to be the top ranked, maybe they should play more tabletop. <laughs> no. oh, lots of people, lots of people. I've heard lots of people say, you know, like, Dave was the third best player in the world and 
and Olivier is the best player in the world and stuff like that. It's just silly, isn't it? It's silly because, like, how variable the NAF rankings are. Like, that makes it more impressive that Olivier stayed number one ranked for so long, right? Because they are so variable. But, like, 40 people didn't get better than Dave all during Euro Bowl, did they? <laughs> you know? <laughs> Jesus Christ, PC. <laughs> Some oh, people won't get that's a joke. <laughs> that is pretty funny. And true to be told, I think that they're still playing just most of by a sportsmanship by uh, Olivier to give uh, Jimmy a full final than actually uh, an actual blue ball game. That is what it is, isn't it? I, this is what Rats yeah. are like, you know? This is what Rats are like. The, the last yeah, yeah, two but I mean, the fact, the fact that he hasn't conceded, the fact that he hasn't conceded, oh, yeah, I mean, no, nobody could blame uh, Oliver if now says, okay, it's over, see you later. Yeah, yeah, that's that's fair, that's fair. Like, it wouldn't matter at all to anything, but yeah, it is nice that he's, he's clicking the buttons till the end. <laughs> You know what you could do to make the things a bit like that? I saw that in a Warcraft 3 video. When well, there's a competition and it was very quick, when nobody was expecting it to be, you know, a best of five uh, ending in just three games, mm. they added like half an hour of black screen at the end. Yeah, yeah. So you click the video is an hour, an hour and a half. Oh, here you go. This gonna be. And suddenly I was like, wait, what? Yeah, someone said I should do that on like you know the cup games. Just like add black screen till the end, till it like goes to like say two hours yeah, or whatever. Or Artemis, game. Artemis games, uh, eighty-nine mm. minutes of black screen to make a, yeah. an hour and a half video. It's not a bad idea, honestly, because like you know, then it does, it does, it it was fair, like you know, because someone said like you know they were watching like I think say Dimmy's game, and then they saw how long was left, so they knew it was going to overtime. And I was like, oh yeah, I didn't think of that, but. I don't know if like YouTube can add black screen to the end, like automatically. I could do it then, but if I've got to just do it manually to the video, there's no way I'm gonna do it. Okay, just scores in case I guess like, you know, something happened with a good uh, the rogue getting the rogue on the ball. Um, and obviously two nil up it's basically over, right? Olivier can one turn here and then have a chance to make it two two. Oh, there is a chance, there is a chance. If there is a turn, there is a chance. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the algorithm, yeah, the glorious algorithm. You could add the reactions to one wall, one blue wall, with you just saying, uh huh, every three minutes. <laughs> <laughs> just you know 30 minutes of black screen at the end of Elliot saying don't say it's over <laughs> it's not over <laughs> I am here <laughs> that'd be brilliant It was pretty much all, yeah. I, I, I thought it was always going to go that way. I, th I mean, I thought it was going to go either an easy win for Andy or, you know, a, a wild match. That's like a, it was never going to be like you know a, a kind of a close to one grind. I don't think it's. They tend to be blowouts one or the other, right? Other beer matches, like just the way he plays. Um. So. We've got the same strategies before of pal the the wraith and then push him into the um into the hole. So it looks like he's not doing that, he's gonna surf the zombie and score in two and then like hope for a blitz or a timeout. Full screen is leprechaun, yeah. Yeah, Dimmy versus Andy would have been interesting. I mean, Dimmy versus Olivia was interesting, wasn't it? If if Andy if Dimmy had got better dice, you know, actually banged out some rats, 
I made a game for it, name, game of it, but um, didn't get the uh, Dave O level bang out. Oh, quick snap! That would have made the one turn easier. I hope the roger kills the gutter run now. Again, no offence to Olivier, but uh, <laughs> I just, I just Here we go, this is it. I just delight in Rattle failure. No, oh, he doesn't. So. Gets him. KO. Yeah. And now... The classic two-turn rat attempt. Mm. Pick it up hand off, can't you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you can just go for the hand off. Maybe now yes. he's got some other rats there, right? In the general vicinity. Seems the best time to do a handoff now. And he declares, and he goes. Uh -oh. Rolls a one. Last three roll gone. Right, last roll gone. Everything that could go wrong went wrong. Oh, they say they step and runs like the wind. <laughs> this line up and base somebody, can't he? Maybe he's one of the wraiths. No, one of the wolves. And that closes. Oh. Whoa, dodgy boy. <laughs> dodgy boy. Well, that looks like Olivia is going to score on turn 15, doesn't it? This looks very difficult. Yes, to yes, and this could end being a 2-1, so it looks like, you know, it was close. Yeah, yeah. And then if he gets a blitz or a riot, uh, sorry, timeout, a blitz or a timeout, then he's got half a chance to pull it back to 2-2. Two -two. The tiniest chance. That happens, I think we could uh, feel Andy rolling his eyes all over the world. <laughs> yeah, that, I mean, Andy would have to be shockingly unlucky to, for it to get a 2 2. And then, even if it did get a 2 2, you'd still imagine that um, Andy would win in overtime. So, yeah. It's just a blitz now, isn't it, that can save him? Uh, or a timeout. A timeout, yeah. Good, good suggestion, Jim. Thanks, Tim. <laughs> Brutal game. Good evening, Benny Bartes. Oh. oh. Full pal. Andy thinks it's over. <laughs> One day, Angelina Jolie will be mine. Oh, peace. I don't know why it's a peace. I've seen you there for a while. But hello, peace. And uh, yeah, Angelina Jolie, you never know. Never say Depends never. Depends if Angelina Jolie likes or dislikes Ian McKellen. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe Serene can introduce you. Um, he's very one-sided, yeah, yeah. All, all the armor breaks that Dimmy didn't get versus Olivier and we got. So, uh, In one turn. Yeah. I mean, it's the aggressive playstyle, though, right? Isn't it? it? It can be punished. Like, it's uh, like there are games where it's going to happen if, if you're in that much contact yeah. that often. Number ten, fifteen, nothing to do. It's got a mighty Wait. blow, bang. 
And then Sky's got no rerolls. Maybe he doesn't mighty blow bang. I think he's gonna. He I mean, shouldn't. He, anyway. he should score. Shouldn't he? Yeah, yeah he's gonna get I lucky. Mean, I think. Yeah. yeah get rid gonna... of the fan farmer. Yeah. Kill this guy. Score. Get a blitz. Maybe a chance. Yeah. Yeah, he's gonna get so Lisa. lucky. But... Okay, two bad. one two turns for Andy. It all comes to the kickoff result <clears throat> now. So it's one in six for a kickoff event that could change the outcome of the game. There you go. Which isn't isn't that bad, really, is it? When you think about it. I mean, yeah. Right. Sometimes you have to roll a hard six. He's putting the uh, sides up on the LOS in case in case he gets you know in case he just doesn't get powered so he can chain him forward. Nice. So he has extra, he has extra chances, not just the riot or, or uh, blitz. It is yet yeah, ten versus nine. Bizarrely, Olivier's up players now. Crazy. Well, eh? what's happening here? What has happened here? <laughs> I mean, it's been a one-sided event, but the, the first roll of Andy was double skull, so that's 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 beyond unlucky. That uh, mm. that cancels any conversation. <laughs> 11 versus 9. I 11? Counting. Yeah, it's not even 10 yet, it's 11. Count, count, counting's overrated PC, like you said earlier. <laughs> Man. <laughs> That's crazy, isn't it? It is. It's also kind of irrelevant. It is. We will see. We'll see. I kind of hope for a blitz or a timeout. Not, no disrespect to Andy. Like, just give us a couple of turns of like terror. Just make it almost interesting. <laughs> yeah, give us some like. It would be a bit sad. It would just sort of limp out if it was a a high kick or something. Crap. Yeah. I guess, like you say, he has given himself the. Uh, the counter one turn right with the side step on the LOS. That's quite interesting to see. Yeah. But uh I'm pretty sure he's getting three dice to block. Ah, it looks like he isn't, right? It looks like he's not getting he's just gonna ignore him and put a fresh in him so he can't get chained. We can put the Wraith in and then blitz it right. Oh no, let's put the wolf there. And in we go. Ooh. Blitz! Oh blitz! my oh goodness. My blitz! God. Oh my goodness. So we blitz in the wraith and running the bludger down the side or what? Yeah, unfortunately he split his gutters so he can't, he's, one's got to just dodge through without dodge. And the other one can yeah. like get blitz through. Or unless he blitz, oh he can't put the side stepper through. Oh no, they could both come through the middle, right? You can blitz the, right, you, okay. everything yeah, can come the through the middle, you can just blitz this fleshy. And everything could come through the middle. Four How players through the middle. Five players. Yeah. Yeah, his, his, his gutters are on the outside, though. Which yeah. Is, you need four in Fritz. So, yeah, this is the first action. Juggernaut. OP. Don't care what you say. Full powers into removal? No. Yep. I mean, Rogue are pretty good this turn. All right. Now we need score in Fritz. And all of them. That's not a score in Fritz. Gutter can get this. The wrestle gutter can get to there, and this gutter. You can't use dodge on a blitz, can you? No, so he, he only gets to there, so he moves him last. So he, he wants to get like probably this lineman just right. Oh, we could cheer for him base the goo. Do it. Do it. So we could do a GFI with the gutter to get to <coughs> there. Oh. No. Yeah. So now, he, the reason, so the reason to do that GFI, it looks stupid, right? But by doing the GFI, it means that this guy could have then GFI to base the ghoul. So uh, it was it definitely the right to, he decision. He just needs to get the wrestler down, and that's GG, right? Yeah. Because the mighty blow is not a scoring threat. One, two, three, four, five, mm. six, seven, eight, nine. And then it's just his miserable hope at. 
Fane in that side, stepper forward through <laughs> Stan Farmer. Yeah. Oh, he's also hasn't got rerolls anyway, Olivier. So you know he's going to have to GFI to get in scoring range anyway. So yeah, it was definitely right to GFI mm. there, and then this this line rat was going to come through and GFI to base the goal. I don't even know if I base the goal, man. I like just get the line rat through. You need two scoring threats. Well, he was definitely going to, otherwise he'd have just got it through first, right? He'd have just moved. Yeah, through first. but I think I just don't think like uh, with the amount that's on the line, like I think. I mean, I'm normally all for rolling all the dice, but the problem is now is all he has to do is knock the wrestler down and it's game over. Whereas yeah. if the lino was there, I mean, yeah, he's going to be tagged by seven guys, but there's, mm. there's just a, chance, a two plus, then is it just a two plus? Mm. So what what do we need here? We need like hex skulls basically to. He 3D's into 3D as well, doesn't he? So it's like yeah, it's just mm hex -hmm. goals, yeah, hex goals. But like the pushes are fine, right? If he gets two pushes, oh no, if he gets two pushes, they're still in range. Right? Yeah, he is. Yeah. I guess Wrestles him. That's is that good enough? That's game. Maybe over. not. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. G if I do. Well, he needs to be chained forward one square. Yeah, and he's got a, he's got a guy to punch right there. So it's a very yeah. easy chain. He might get fouled though. Zombie dodge foul. Wolf foul. Uphill, uphill the roger. Wolf with foul. With the golem. Oh, wolf foul. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. No. Oh, screening. That would. I think I. Or ghoul foul. <laughs> ghoul ball. Picks it up. Oh my oh, God! Really? His pickup has been unbelievable. Yeah, he's he's passed every single pick up in the range. Yeah, that's probably game one. <laughs> Yeah, because now he's got to And that's all, folks. There was a chance, there was a, the, the glimpse of a dream, of a hope. Yeah, really decent chance. Really decent chance, right? You just have to fill in there. In fact, no, you could have just filled in here with this one. And then just directly blitters in, pushing forward. So if that had been a fail pickup. It was an easy chain forward, and then like a couple of like twos three, and pick up. Yeah, it would have been a three, two, 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 two. Something. It would have been pretty easy. Like it would have been crazily, it would have been pretty easy if the pickup had been failed. Wow. Well, it was a one in nine. No, uh, it was four plus. So 75. it was a seventy-five percent. Seventy-five percent. Give me my money. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's gambling doesn't pay. It did for half the people think so. <laughs> but so, Alicia, gambling Alicia pays one? when you choose right. Mm. Oh, I'm, I'm going to wait just until it's official. Yeah, and make sure you pay out the right side, Demi. <laughs> yeah, I'm paying out the people who predicted Olivia. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you can, you can chain him forward easily, but um, he can't sack the ball. He can't sack the ball if he does that. Jump. So, oh no, no, no! He can, he can, he can fill in these two squares and this one, right? And then you can block him into there, into there, into there. I touch him. Fill in oh, all that. these squares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven squares. Fill in seven squares. He's got seven players. Easy. Yeah, but then how do you sack the ball? Um, by double powering him on the blitz. Easy. Oh, it's doable, yeah. It's doable. It's doable, still, yeah. You can still do it the other way by blitzing the goal and then chaining him. And then he just has to dodge in, double pow, pick it up and score. The scatter has to go the right way as well. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the problem is the chain is really fucking hard. Because you've got to fill in six players to chain it. No, you don't. You hit the goal. You just fill the square below the wrestler. Yeah, but how, how, do, you, how do you hit the goal and the ball? Oh, so you can do I it with see. this block. This guy can block it by filling in all six squares and then this square 
and then he blocks this one into this one into this one and then this one blitzes rolls doubles pals and that's it so yeah that's what he's, he's doing it he's doing it he's doing the right play it should be there you go there you go uh, oliver when it comes to desperate plays gets the right one <laughs> i can't wait i can't wait for him to fill all the squares and then roll foul appearance <laughs> 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 to like furiously translating it. No, I, Olivia knows this, of course. Uh, it just feels to you fine. Okay. Complete prediction. Olivier won. <laughs> and now he's uh, wow. finished 2 1. For uh, Andy Devo, congratulations, two times uh, BBS uh, Blood Bowl Super League champion. Yeah. First one in history. Yeah, First won, one it in in history. won it in Blood Bowl 2 and in Blood Bowl 3. There you go. Pretty impressive. Well, not pretty impressive, is it? It's incredibly impressive. The highest competition. Highest level, high, highest overall level of competition. Uh, yeah, it's it's as ball. impressive. I'm, I'm hearing the soundtrack of Jurassic Park right now. Amazing result. Congratulations to Andy Diabo. Commiserations to Olivier. Yeah. It was a rough game. It was, but it was a heroic effort from Olivier in the end. Got the blitz, tried the chain. It was uh, pretty incredible, wasn't it? So, uh, yeah, great battling from Olivier. Commiserations to him. But, yeah, fantastic stuff from Andy. Two-time BBSL champ. Unbelievable. And uh, thank you very much, Fania and Dimmy. Glorious having you guys in the booth. Glorious. Always a pleasure to be here, and I hope our viewers in Fiji enjoy the game. Yeah. And... Uh, <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.